Okay, so what I have here is the Sartorius SPA series hood with uh, two balances in here. I have a TE6100, which is a 6100 gram by one gram, and I have a Cubis MSA 6202P, which is a 6200 by 0.01 gram, and it's also poly range. Um, we'll be using the low range uh, to see the drift, as you can see right now with it. Um, so what I'm going to do is to show you the differences between the Q-Grid and the, also the two different balances in the, the resolution. So you have the Cubit just fluctuating, as you can see. Well, it's a two-place balance, all the airflow going through there. You would expect it. And you have a one gram balance. It's actually pretty steady. And now what I'm going to do is put some weights on there and we'll see if it'll make a difference. So as you can see, the cubis is still fluctuating a little bit. I have a glare. And that's with 100 grams on there. And then you have 150 grams. Pretty solid. TE series. Now, as you notice, that's with the glass just halfway down. There's also another level of glass that I can put down. So as I put that second plexiglass down, you can probably see that it's fluctuating a lot more. It's a two place balance. You've got a one gram readability. See a little bit of fluctuation, not as bad. That's because the airflow is going underneath now. It's only taking that little area for the airflow. Now, what I'm going to do is put the Q grid on the Cubis and uh, see what kind of difference it makes. I'm going to position this on the side. Support off, pan off, draft ring, put this new pan support with the Q grid on. And this draft ring on there. And finally, we're going to put the Q grid. What kind of difference it makes. You can see right from the beginning, fairly stable. And that's with the glass open. I'm going to close the first layer. I think that little fluctuation was from me touching the uh, the hood, so I'm gonna tear it out. Okay, now I'm gonna put some weight on it. And you 
can see the difference between the stability now with the Q grid on. Last but not least, I'm going to close this last layer. Still fluctuating, but one or two digits. Seems like because of the air pressure change, it loses uh, weight also. Once I open it, right to zero. There you have it. Pretty solid. You have your uh, one gram balance. It's an older model, TE6100, but it's still pretty solid. Holding at 150. So, there you have it.